Hello, welcome to my group dial. Today we will be rearranging some numbers. Alright, ready? <laughs> and Hello, welcome to Master's Now. Today we'll be rearranging some numbers. What numbers do you have, Niall? Four, seven and six. Four, seven and six. We're going to see how many three-digit numbers we can make using those numbers. We have two rules. Can you tell us what they are? We're not allowed to use one of these numbers more than once. And we can't use any numbers that aren't on the board. Okay, so can you start, please? Um, so we'll start with four ch now, so four seventy six because four seven six. Okay, so four seven six. And what number is that? Four hundred and seventy six. Four hundred and seventy six. What are you gonna do next? And we can still make another four one actually because. 467. Oh, that's good. 4, 6. So, 4, 67. 467. Okay, so you have two numbers there that in the 400s. Can you make any more that start with 400? Um, no. No. Unless we, would, we, unless we could use the number more than once. But we can't. Yes. Sir. So, let's go. What are you going to do next? Um, my sevens, and, and now that we know that with two seven, that we would need two books, we could do, we would do two sevens. Okay. So I'll just put them down like that. So seven. what you're saying, you're going to have two numbers that start with seven. Yeah. Okay. So what are the two numbers? Show us. Seven hundred forty-six. Okay. Good. Seven hundred forty-six. Forty-six. Seven hundred and forty six you said. Oh that's it, sixty four. Does it matter? Well if you say seven hundred and forty six you should put seven hundred and forty six. Okay. So tell me the difference with those two numbers. After you put the seven hundred, what did you do with the other two numbers? Um I put a four here and a six here, and a four here and a six. Okay, here. so you put you just swapped it around. Yeah. So you did sixty four on one and forty six on one. Okay, yeah. good. So we have seven hundred and sixty four and seven hundred and forty six. Are there any other numbers you can make using those three numbers? I mean, yeah, with the six we could. Yeah. Okay, we can start with any the six. with six. Okay. Two sixes. Okay, so you're using two. You might need to move those across the left a bit. Okay. And put them here, and then six forty-seven we could do. Mm -hmm. So what number is that? Six hundred and forty-seven. Yes. And then six hundred and seventy-four. Very good. Are there any other numbers you can make using those? Mm, no, unless we could use numbers more than once. Okay, so six numbers in all. Which number there is the biggest number, Naya? Um, well, it's definitely one that starts with the 7 because 7 it has the most in the hundreds. Okay. And then 7, okay, so this one's bigger because it has 6 tens. This only has 4 tens. Oh, very good. So you compare the hundreds first and you found the two numbers that had the most hundreds, yeah. which was 764 and 746. And then you compare the what? And... Then I compared the tens. Oh, that's good, that's good. The so 764 units, is the biggest number. Yeah, the units don't really make, make the number bigger. Oh, it doesn't matter in this case because no. the tens already tells us which one's yeah. bigger. So tens using that hundreds. same idea, which number would be the smallest one? Um, one and four, because four is the smallest number. Mm -hmm. So this one, because... Six is smaller than seven. So what number is it? 467. Okay, great. So here's what I want you to do. I want you to take all of those numbers off the board and make a new number at the top. Okay. Five, two, and eight. Okay, good. Now we're going to put them in order 
from the smallest. What's the plan? Okay, so um, let me get my two. I'll put one two here and another two here. So these are my two, these are going to be my two smallest numbers. And then I'm going to put a five here and another five here because yeah and then so and then these are my two numbers so what are those numbers 258 and 285 okay and why did you choose to put the first five and eight in those positions um because it's smaller okay so we started with the smallest yeah so the five would be smaller okay good so let's do the next two numbers that we would have which is going to be five because five is the next smallest number okay so five and five so they're going to, both going to be in the five hundreds yes um, and then here's my two and then here's my eight and then here's my other two and then here's my other eight okay good so tell us what tell us about those two numbers. Okay, so this is five hundred and twenty-eight, and this is five hundred and eighty-two, and I've put them in this order because we're doing smallest to largest. Okay, and how many more numbers can we make? We can make two more because remember we are, we can only make six numbers. Mm -hmm. So eight and eight, um, eight and eight, five and. Five, two and three. Okay. Okay, there's something not right about that. Can you explain? What did you do? I got them the wrong way around. What was wrong with the order? This was a five. Yes. And then this was a two. Yes, and why was that not correct is what I mean. Because it wasn't in order smallest to largest. Okay, it is. So now it's in order smallest to largest. So you already, you've already ordered those numbers. It's very easy for me to ask you questions. Yeah. What's the biggest number that you've made? 852. What's the smallest number that you've made? 258. What's the biggest even number that you've made? Um, 500, 800. 52. Can you show us what you're talking about? What's the biggest even number that you've made? This is the biggest even number because it ends with a 2. Yes. So it's an even number if it ends in a 2. And then this has the most hundreds. Okay. So, so okay. what's the biggest odd number? 825. Can you point out the biggest odd number? 825. Because it ends in an odd number. Yeah, and it has an 800, which makes it the biggest. Okay, so are you ready for quiz time? Of course I am, I always are. Okay, so I'm going to give you three numbers, and I want you to tell me the biggest number that you can make with the three numbers. Okay, that's the The first the number is... Four, the second is eight, and the third is five. Eight hundred and fifty-four. Correct. Yippee, yippee, yay. I'm going to give you another three numbers, and I want to know the smallest number that you can make. The first number is two, the second number is seven, and the third number is one. Two, seven, and one. 721. That's not the smallest number, that's the biggest uh, number. 127? Correct, 127. Last one. It's going to be tricky. Okay. The first number is 9, the second is 8, and the third is 7. So nine, eight, seven. Yes. So literally put them in order for me. Okay, nine, eight, seven. Nine hundred and seventy-eight. I didn't no. ask the question uh, yet. Uh, uh, so we have nine, eight, seven. What is the smallest odd number that we can make with nine, eight, 
seven. Seven hundred eighty nine. Correct. Yippee yippee! Very good. Okay, that was a good lesson. So we're going to see you guys next time. If you like that video, subscribe now. Bye. Bye.